welcome back. It's no more school. I'm done. I'm Spray. Hey, Mr. Sprayberry. I uh, noticed that we're both wearing blue today. Wait, we are? Yeah. I, I, I'm colorblind. Oh, this was an accident? This is what was clean. <laughs> well, well I, I wore blue today because I'm standing up against bullying. Bullying is bad. I will also claim that's the reason I wore this. That's right. That's right. So don't bully me. I jerk. <laughs> all right. All right. Shall we get into it? We should get into it. So I've got an eighth grade announcement here. Go for it. And this is for anybody in eighth grade or anybody who wants to contribute to eighth grade. So we're doing a fun lab this Friday, and we still need some things for that lab. It's the s'more lab. So if you've got marshmallows and crackers and Hershey's chocolate that you would like to contribute for that lab, please send it in to us before Friday, preferably Thursday, because we need to know how much that we have so we can divvy it up amongst our students. What do you need to heat those s'mores? Um, we're gonna use um, some heat sources like tea, tea lights and things like that. Do so you need those? If you need, if you got them, bring them. Cool. All right, we want to wish the best of luck to our all-county chorus students this Tuesday. Good luck. Bring home the thing. Trophy? Get the get gold. the win. Go for the gold. Go for the gold. And if you get the silver, that's good, too. Um, chorus concert is this Thursday here at school at 7 o'clock. I'm pretty sure it's 7. I put 7, but I'm hoping that's right. 7. If Better to be early than late. Yes. So 6.30 to 7. Um, community night this Friday, the high school football game is going to be recognizing our middle school athletes. Come out and support the Central Spartans, the smaller ones. And if you're involved in campus life, you will meet this Thursday and every Thursday at 3.05. Make sure that your ride knows um, to pick you up. And do we have a pickup time for them? Uh, no. Okay, so you're going to want to tell your ride to pick up time, so Campus Life people try to figure that out. Yes. That's what we need you to do. And up next is... All right, so for sports this week, we've got uh, the thought ball at home this Tuesday. All right, we got a football game this Wednesday. Um, please, students, make sure that you wear your camo colors. That's camouflage, right? Your camouflage colors to support our team. Does the colors work? Like if I wear a black shirt and like forest green pants? Is I, that... I mean, what if you live in the city? Do you wear urban camo? Whoa. If you're in the woods, that's a different type of camo. So whatever camo you got, wear it and support our football team. That way you can blend in from class. I'm going to wear a camo top. So do you have one? I, I can make one. Oh, okay. You know? Well, we're going to move on to... We're back. Oh, sorry. Wow, is that you can do that dance. <laughs> the Carlton. <clears throat> the sixth grade competed once again for the testing championship, and we have the results. Oh my god. In first place, the Warriors. Yes. And in second place, by one tenth oh. of one point, the Titans. They did not tighten it up enough. They did, did they? not. Yeah, just that much, y'all. Damn Following much. closely behind is the Gators. Mr. Carter was not found in his room when I went for comment, but he was later discovered hiding in the bathroom eating a pint of cookie dough. <laughs> That's his thing, guys. When he when we asked him for comment, he said, vroom, 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 vroom. we can only assume that means tighten it up. Tighten it up. Yeah. He did want to express his displeasure at the fact that his team has yet to win the belt. It's a tenth of a point, you know? It's like Right? I told him. Test strategies, you know? I told him round. If you round, <laughs> it would have been a tie. But he said, no, we're going to do it the right way and all that. Yeah. Well, uh, I don't have anything else, Mr. Sprayberry. Should we end with a good quote? I think we should. Okay, I got one for you. Life is like a box. No, that's not it. No, no it's not it. copyright. <laughs> Life is about 10% what happens and about 90% of how you react to what happens. I think that's perfect. Yep. Especially when talking about the bullying thing. That works out. That's exactly. Exactly. Just because somebody says something doesn't mean you need to listen. Exactly. I don't listen at all. <laughs> oh, wait. My turn. Um, yep. Good, better, best. Never let it rest till your good is better and your better is best. Well, that's all we got time for. Bye.